what's good humble squad it's your boy humble ziggy we back here with music mayhem for y'all and look we got seven songs here today so we just gonna go straight right into it and search and it's basically like this sorry and it sorry about that i don't know why that always happens whenever i go into screen especially for obs but either way we got one that was a cash app request and it's from zay the boy as you see we got the gohan rap just saying a pure a pure old juice cell response i sell this so basically he's always doing this he did it the last time which was with if i'm not mistaken the toji one and such so gojo and such so Let's see how he does it with this one. So we about to check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me and all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. Sell better behave. Oh shit. Or it's Kameha, Meha, Meha. Say you got purpose, that's what I'm just saying. Why not the squad now? I'm just saying. I make it fun now, I'm just saying. Just saying, what? Said he got purpose, that's what I'm just saying. Why not the squad now? I'm just saying. I ain't making fun now, I'm just saying. Just saying, what? Just saying that I check him like a check late. One swing, now you're losing all this breath rate. Now your kids all losing all the birth rates. Well, you kids did, but they got to hurt, right? Think I'm weak, well, I ain't the one. Not you, Gen Z, you is my son. Now pipe down, this is for fun. I am Gen Z, you is my son. Damn. Look. And like I said this before many times, I may, I may was born two thousands, right? I may was born in two thousand, maybe born into the Gen Z, but with the whole thing with them in nowadays, I am nowhere near their type of agreeance with certain things, or most things for that matter. But they. I like the beat. Mm. 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 I guess in a way you can see where these like theories about how Gohan has like PTSD and such. And I would, it's basically this, I would too, if knowing that when I was 10, I started catching bodies like selling shit if I was 10 years old. When I was 10 years old, I would have PTSD too. Like shit. He switch. You say you the best, you say you a fighter. We have more trouble against Majin Buu. Mm. Mm. You ain't me. Channel my rage and that's the key. How you claim you a perfect self, you lost to a boy like me. Damn. I mean, it is true, like, nigga. I don't know y'all see me. I'm like literally down here if y'all know where I'm at. But damn, that if that ain't some true facts right there. How you gonna claim that you perfect when you got been beaten from a boy like me? A 10 year old boy? It's just like this. You can never say that you a boss nigga whatever when you just got sunned by somebody who's literally a son of somebody else. Because once you hear that, I'm sorry. You can never claim that you're that nigga ever again if you got sunned by, a, by somebody else's son. <laughs> Couldn't be me, I'm sorry. I got purpose, that's what I'm just saying. Watch out the squad, now I'm just saying. I make it fun, now I'm just saying. Just saying, wait. Said they got purpose, that's what I'm just saying. Watch out the squad, now I'm just saying. I make it fun, now I'm just saying. Just saying, boy. Hey, shout out to Zay Boy, he did his thing. And now we got Mix William with Razor Sharp. Rest in peace to Scott Hall, man. 
I will never forget his most famous quote and such. Hard works pays off. Dreams come true. Bad, bad times don't last, but bad guys do. Rest in peace to Sh Scott Hall, a.k.a. Razor Ramon, a.k.a. Chico. <laughs> and crazy that you will never get another bad guy like him ever again. But rest in peace to him. You better do this. Makes all I'm gonna say is you have better find a way how to put that fam his famous quote in there. You better. You better put that in there or else I'll be mad. There is a Ramon. There is a Ramon too. Me and hate me, I'm still gonna do what I do. Mm. Why would they try if they knew they would lose? They probably couldn't step their game up if it was glued to their shoes. I'm not famous, mm. but I played a part. Leather vest, gold chain, I'm feeling brave and sharp. Problem. Get ready for my reign just in case it starts. My mm. dad said, Better get on track before the train departs. Got married and paid. I break the bank and still breaking hearts. They send a shot. And the thing is, Scott Hall had a lot of famous quotes, but it's just that. Main one that when he got inducted into the Hall of Fame, it's just that main one people are always going to remember him. So I think that was a quote right there where it says, better get on track before the train departs. I think that was one of his main quotes too. If I'm if I'm wrong, let me know in the comments below. Track me for the train departs, got married and paid. I break the bank and still break it. Picking hearts. Mm. They send the shots, I send them back. I didn't order that. Mm. They swan whack, but they still jamming like a cornerback. I mm. keep the peace, they turn to violence, they don't want to rap. I'm all in my bag like my wife shopping at Nordstrom Rack. Mm. Going hard as I can. Living rich and dying broke was never part of the plan. Mm. And sometimes I do prefer to watch my team from the stands. But if shit hits the fan, it's red dots like Japan. I never drop. It hits the fan and it's red dots like Japan. Shout out to the land of the rising sun. Turn to watch my team from the stands, but if shit, shit hits the, the fan, fans, red dots that's like the Japan. Japan. I never drop crazy rap, still a fifth of my income. Mm. And the features dried up because the price got expensive. Ain't mm. saying everybody's lying. Y'all ask for help and I'm trying. Got imaginary racks when it's time to actually spend some. Y'all shit. That ain't look, if that ain't how it is nowadays. Got a lot of people talking about they got the big racks and all that. Nigga, no, you're not. <laughs> Stop lying. Last for help and I'm trying. Got imagine every racks. racks. Time to actually, actually spend them. Y'all fake rich. And I ain't rich. I get by pretty good. I just don't say shit. Mm. That's why I don't move a muscle unless it makes sense. That's why mm. I sneak this. We don't make amends. We make hits. I don't know. And that's so true, nigga. Like. And that's what. Let's think about this. Don't, that's such a good thing. That's like smart right there. Don't say nothing unless it don't involve you or if it don't make sense. If it don't make sense or it don't involve you or anybody who you know, shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up and keep on going. It makes sense. That's why y'all sneak this. We don't make amends. We make mm -hmm. hits. I don't know how to be humble, gotta learn to My work ethic's something that really don't concern you Say I don't deserve the top, I must have misheard you That fire mm. in my heart, that passion burns through mm. That passion burns through Know my life's been hard in the past Now the world's in the palm of my hands mm. You won't never ever catch Game's me Game's the first back. person shooter Adversity thrown in my face Me and X on a track like he's cold and I'm Drake mm. It's been dropping garbage, better throw that away I feel like Kobe today you see Best the team Kobe. up when we link, it's like a solar array, y'all boys frozen in See the team eat up when we link, it's like a solar, or solar array Mmm, mmm Come on, I know see the team heat up uh, when, when we, we link, link, it's like a solar, solar array, array. Y'all boys frozen in place with your fake ice Sometimes mm. I take a breath, take a time out mm. I don't play nice, odds against us, different numbers, different sides like playing dice you dealt your cards and you play them right mm. I give the same advice to kids coming up That I got back when I started That getting started is the hardest To stay focused on your targets Like We always get caught up like a fucking Usher song That's why <laughs> I think whenever stuff goes wrong We all go up in arms Instead of building foundation 
shit don't go right we go up in arms up in arms like we going crazy and such but we go up in arms instead of building bro that just goes to show you if you don't got that like it's basically well what i say <laughs> it's basically like this if you don't got that like discipline type factor in you it don't you can start at young teenage years or whatever you don't got that like discipline factor about you where you know sometimes shit ain't always gonna go your way and such but if anyhow you the first instinct of you is to start raising your arms up and such honestly to me if you can't find a way how to calm it down because not all the time you gotta go this and such use this first before you start using this or this Cause that be destroying a lot of communities nowadays. That instead of you trying to talk it out, you instead want to do this or this. I think whenever stuff goes wrong, we all go up, up in, in arms instead, instead of, of building, building foundations. foundations. You know, like something strong. Like I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You see my man playing FIFA background. Wish he would have put more. Wish he would have put more like references. Oh, Razor Ramon, aka Scott Hall, and such. But hey, man, either way, it's all good. Rest in peace to Scott Hall, like I said. But we on to the next song with Diggs the Prophecy with his Maki Ma rap song, Control Devil, featuring Mir Blackwell and Professor Curl. Let's get it. Ooh, 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 ooh. First of all, if that's st I pro that's pretty much Star Girl. Hold on, Diggs, you gotta. F you know what? Let me not say nothing. Like shit. But I gotta say though. I do not like, you know what? I do not like a freaking moaning in my ear about somebody's name and whatnot. Unless it's not my name from another girl. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> but never mind. Oh my God. Keep up. Fuck your shit, your team, man. Bring it to my region. Just to fill up on the pennies. I don't need another reason. Big old booty is the season. Cuffing on my head until it's done. Please don't wake me up from dreaming. Mm. I've seen the afterlife. Just a tug will bring me. In fact, you got mirror on this. Definitely fits it. Back to life. What the fuck just made me at the five? That's luck. She'll bring me back tonight. Hope in the balls. That's sad. She can feel it. That is right. I'm trying to lead a seven. I just realized what this beat is. It's that wop. This nigga just featured. Put on freaking wop. Now like Megan Stallion wop. Listen. Tripping, mind your business. Mm. I'ma get inside mm. the thickness. Perfect shape. She fine with fitness. Make her do it. I'ma hit this. I'm physique at the peak. Homie, I'ma need a witness. Mm. Technique got me weak. But I'm standing at attention. Why? Panic, get it this beat though. Mir? Okay. <laughs> Mir gonna go freaky on this shit. See, I need a mock of my child me. Do not Ooh. give a time while she mocking me. She don't mm. my chain when she locked me. Do what she says, she gonna stop the autonomy. Watching the devil take control of me. I take her dreams and say it over beats. I had the scheme to take her home with me. She had the scheme to get a hold of me. See, shorty, but like the fan art. I hate the man, dark life is straight to the bank. I might make a play for the play. That's that make it safe for the day. I even take the taste off the play. We never face the faces, but like face the waste, but I'm faded inside. I face the waste. Mir would definitely fit this without a shadow of a doubt. The freakiness, especially when it's a Makima song, hell yeah, this fits his. Bang. Mm. 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 And she let me eat it like I'm Jeff Dahmer. Oh, cannibal looking ass. Nah. I did say, I've said it many times before, that with Mir, 
and digs those two are the ultimate waifu snatchers and you cannot tell me otherwise Yes, I dropped the hammer, she said yes on her. Mm. I be like yes, mama, I'm a pest till I start to flex on her. Mm. I believe your walls wreck, mama. When I'm done, still got a rest on her. Like mm. this nigga really put a snow. Like I wanna know how the hell Professor Cur If Professor Curl comes freaky as hell on this, I'ma respect the professor way more. <laughs> <laughs> What's this sample from? Yo, get here, come here, bitch. Yeah. What you got, professor? Hold up, little bitch. This is the type of shit. And if you want to choke it till the light show hit, bite mm. your lip to the blood, just becomes mm. another drip mm. inside your wetness. Mm. Whoa, baby, don't matter the flow of the title. The monkey surprise if it's yours and it's mine. So just open the box because I'm coming inside. I'm not saying it twice. Yeah, leash is collar. Hold up a sec. Hold up a cat for a freaking second. Hold up. Let me. Let me. Professor Curl. If you see it, I know you're probably going to see this. Who say you can go freaky like this? Who told this nigga he can come freaky on a song like this? Um. Just when you just when you thought I never liked the professor more when it comes to him explaining bars and then when he comes on a song like this he going to bring his freakiness out nah bring that shit back. go back Hold up, little bitch. This the type of shit that make me wanna choke it till the light show hit. Yeah. Bite your lip till the blood just becomes another drip inside your wet ass. Whoa, baby, don't matter the flow of the title. The monthly surprise if it's yours and it's mine. So just open the thighs cause I'm coming inside. I'm not saying it twice. Nope. Yeah. Leashes, collars, whips, and stockings, teeth, and hollers. We're just starting ropes and cuffs and different bondage. Show yourself their prison of onyx gags. So <laughs> It's basically like this, and this might y'all might look at me a weird when I say this, but I have never heard this nigga go full black on this before, cause I know he is he's light skinned brown. Don't get me twisted. Shout out to all my light skinned brothers out there. But I have never seen him gone this freaky on a song before. <laughs> Like goddamn, Brooklyn cuffs and different bondage. Show yourself there is no onyx gag suck, slobber and show. Close on your mind while you work in my pole. You don't need no thoughts, just my words to take hold. Well, my hands in your head, feel me firmly take hold. Skull, fuck, then I wanna hit you with that dumb. Put on every choice, make you dumb. Just roll in the puddle, want more. More, fuck, show enough. I'm even looking like a glazed donut while you lay quivering. Your body froze up with your toes up. Mm. Nah, you cannot end me off. This nigga, cor <laughs> Nah. Y'all three was pretty as hell on that song. Shout out to y'all three. But now we got Reese with the return with his Gojo rap, Infinite, featuring Gabe Boy Jones. Let's go. He just came in with it. I need to put respect on. Look, for all the underrated artists like Reese and such a nerdcore, y'all, whether it's by AMVs or by features or by your songs, y'all have stepped it up this year. I know this year is coming to an end, almost to an end, but I've got to say, from the likes of Oricadia, Dripstick, I wouldn't say Peso P because 
he's always been up there. But like Orcadia, Dripstick, freaking Reese with his edits and such. Like, bro. I love the underrated artists and such. And I see that Game Boy Jones about to have us feature, have a, gonna release another song and has Tutsi, Tutsuyo on it. Yeah. I be, I be telling you what I've been saying for, if I haven't been saying it, I'm gonna say it now. Or if I have said it, y'all gonna hear me say it again. The underrated nerdcore artists, like recent such, they are bound to get eyes on like, on like the upper nerdcore artists. Cause you see that Reese got a feature with Game Boy Jones. Uh, trust me, I peep it. I can peep it. They keep going to open more and more. I gotta say, I've said it before when it comes to choruses, the likes Game Boy Jones can know how to fit too, but so can Reese. <laughs> How Game Boy won't come on this? Game Boy. Game Boy don't ever say you can't Look, I've said it before And I'm gonna say it again Game Boy We love your pop songs Can't get it twisted Even when you want to go in your little singing mode Don't get me twisted, I love it But nigga This is your lane Stick to your goddamn rapping lane Cause nigga you snap way more harder when you're in your rapping zone. Mm. What a return for Reese. And with a feature like Game Boy, Infinite, bitch, I am the strongest. Yeah, I knew the this, bitch, I am the Hey, hey. definitely playlists after this. Shout out to Reese. And now we got Black Diamonds and Dave D with a Sukuna rap. It's crazy that he was supposed to name this Touchdown, but I guess he going with Akora. Right. Unless I'm thinking of a different song. Pretty sure it's this one. Mm. Sorry. Mm, 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 mm. But the way people have enough, bro. Y'all see what? And the thing is, even though this is what I'm gonna say, even though they might not get me the views that I need, 
nigga, at the end of the freaking day, if there's something, what gravitates to me the most about them is the way how they can freaking go crazy on a song. From the bars, the bars, the bars, the sauce, the lyric, and the AMV, don't get it twisted, everything. So I wouldn't care if this got me like 50 views within a month or so. Just by my level of how I love the songs, I could, I could give two-ish about if it gives me a lot of views. If it gives me a lot of views, or if it does, or if it gives me less views. I like it. But I would appreciate it if y'all run these up and share with others. <laughs> Come on now. Fire on a fifth them. And Black Diamond is another person who knows how to make a hook be catchy as hell. I mean, look. I'm going to say it like this. And I, this is my last time even going to say it. If you can make a hook be catchy, no matter if it's a long one or it's a short one, as long as a melody is there and it's like a catchy type, it gonna, I'm going to like it. Because I like the little yelling and such. He better pray with serpent. serpent. I can't mm, 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 Bro, with Dave D, I've got to say, Dave D, this nigga be killing it with these features. And I figured, and I think like with Dave D, he's going to be another one of them. Because I've said it with, with Orkadi and Dripstick, they've been everywhere as of late. But Dave D is going to be another one. I know he's, it's basically like this. He's reaching there. I know he's keep on growing and growing and more. But I'm just saying. This nigga, Dave D, just knows how to kill it with freaking sauce and bars and shit. Like you watching a slash. Mm. Fucking with me is like fucking with cancer. cancer. Even the flow in the kitchen with daggers. Cancer. We letting off like a million, million slashes. Go ahead, try, bitch. Toss it mm. out. Nah, outside, not be mm. weird. Mm. My domain take lives. Come get it. Mm. I stepped in, y'all bought like mm. that. Mm. Too much pride. My you said what? Take lives. What you was saying, Diddy? I stepped in, y'all bought like that. Mm. I stepped in, y'all bop like Diddy. Crazy that you gotta feature him, but hey, no, nah, actually, never mind. As long as it's in a song, I don't care. Pop like did it. Hey. Mm. 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 I need to get me a car in the very near future because I want to bump some of these songs. Y'all not be because I can guarantee you just by the I can't wait to when I hear this because I got a speaker right here next to me. I can't wait to when I hear this on this speaker. Goddamn, rain is peeling. Matter of fact, I'm adding this right now. Hold up. Now, we're going back to that chorus, but now. Nah. So, if, I'm going to add it right. As if y'all not seen it right now, I'm going to add it. So, hold up. First, let me add Reese's shit. Matter of fact, hold on. I'm going to make sure y'all see it. Y'all going to see me adding it.
Yeah, I'm doing this in the middle of it. Fuck it. Y'all gonna see me. Y'all gonna see me. See? This is stone. It's infinite. Added to both my playlists. Y'all see? I got a saucy. I added to my saucy lit nerdcore. And my traditional nerdcore. And it's right there. Let's try to look at it again. Right there. Both on it. Bam. Right there. Next one. In like diamonds. There. Yep. Yeah, there it is. Coral. Yep. Add to playlist. Both saucy and traditional. Hit it again so that way it confirms it. Yep. Bam. Like that. that. Nigga, you must be out of your mind if you don't think I'm bumping these shits. Especially on my way to work. Hell yeah, I'm gonna bump these motherfuckers. You what? You must be crazy if you don't think I'm not. Get out of here. Back room. Shout out to Octaku Underworld, you already know. I had to. Had to rep it for the one time for the one time. Shout out to them. But now we got Nerd Out with a Lethal Company song. Something funny is going on. What's so crazy? I'm literally watching other. In a way, I'm not playing the game, but I'm watching other YouTubers play this game, and I can guarantee you it's some wonky ass game where you literally have to collect different types of items and such, and it can come with some money. And you literally got until the end, you gotta meet a quota. All I'm saying, it's a crazy game. But let's get it. Something's fun going on. Something fun. Of course, it's naming with this. Something funny's going on, but I don't get it. Yes, I regret it. Coming to this planet. Something funny's going on, but I don't get it. Yes, I regret it. Coming to this planet. Something's funny's going on, but I don't get it. How much longer can we last? Is it worth it for the cash? Don't go too slow, or they just wanna fight it. We just gotta get the goods. We gon' make it out the hood. Just ignore the noise, it's coming up behind it. What do you get? I know what you can do. Just run. <laughs> As I've, like I said, I've seen the gameplay of many other other gaming YouTubers. There ain't no way hell you can be able to kill them. All you just gotta do is run. <laughs> Avoid them at all costs. <laughs> the noise is coming up behind you. What do we do to kill these monsters? I probably do. Something funny's going on, but I don't get it. Yes, 
Osiris credit Coming to this planet Something's funny's going on But I don't get it Yes, I regret it Come to this planet Something funny's going on But I don't get it But I don't get it Shout out to Nerd Out But last and not least We got the man be his love Connection terminated From Friday Nights and Freddy's uh, William Apton pretty sure hold on let me look in the description because i'm pretty sure probably is related to the movie and such that came out oh so apparently it says william apton was the main antagonist of the five nights at freddy's click team series all right Good to know. Not the one still doing learning. Terminated. No feeling mm. worse than hatred. I'll never rest until I see the rest is terminated. Mm. Mm. They may always come back for seconds or serve my place. Mm. Mm. Think and turn in the mm. heat up. Look at me burned away. I'm back, mm. brother. The man behind it. How'd I earn a name like that? Brother, brandish the knife. If you think you're hard up, hey, you're whack, brother. Like in the back, you're like the burn of life. You're talking back to me. I can probably go hard to maybe go like crazy terminal. Sick and urge. I'm uncertain. Just yearning to see him burn in the dish. You locked up and turned away. Turned away. Why he sounds like Tolkien here? <laughs> he particularly sounds like Tolkien. If you haven't, go check out my reaction to Tolkien's most recent freestyle. If I'm not mistaken, it was the, it was the Big Ben freestyle. Go check it out. But he particularly sounds like Tolkien at this part right here. You should reconsider your method of earning pay. Mm. Real reasons, real the reasons I keep living. I'm a real demon. Feel like someone's left within these walls. Still breathing, still don't need a heart to feed up on. Real reasons, really the reasons to kill you all. Really stating the facts, simple as that. Mm -hmm. Got another mm -hmm. missing person when I pick up the axe. Got another mm -hmm. one missing person, they're probably getting murdered. And all of these bodies certainly mm -hmm. will fit in the back. Yeah. And no condolences, catch your body. Dip. One can, in, I don't know what I was saying. The one thing that I can say is, is this the production. I wish you would have like the beat be booming and such. Cause like with the Dave, like with Black Diamond song and freaking Reese's, the beat was booming. And the others too. The beat was booming and such. But I feel like there's like a lack of it. Otherwise from that. The song itself so far. Sounds pretty good. It's just that beat. Mm -hmm. 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 Mm -
leather. Stop him, dead. Feeling uneven, I'm out in head. You're a killer, the man to steal. You're a killer, the back of feathers. A killer, the for the pleasure. We're being done under pressure. A killer, hallucinations of spirits on in the rest. We'll never settle for that. Always come back, you better. But settle now and forever. Which half remembers the better one? We all Ooh, that little guitar, that bass guitar right there. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I don't cry, I, I won't scream, I don't die. I, still me. Mm -hmm. I won't lie, I don't bleed all this time. It's still me. I like the electronic I voice cry, type vibe. I like how it's like the electronic type vibe where because like how it's a game and such and like how it's robotic and such like how it feels like he's a real robotic like a real anime animatronic and such talking through this perspective of him in a devilish sort of way die is still me Really? <laughs> the Patreon? Being out with the ending part where you had the bass booming and such, you could have had it throughout the entire song. But regardless, it was still fire nonetheless. But hey, shout out to everybody else who was in this and such from freaking Diggs. Freaking, oh yeah, I gotta get, I gotta make sure I download the, this Diggs is Makima on my song, on my playlist. What? Because all three of these niggas went freaky as hell on that shit. But hey, either way, shout out to everybody who was involved in this, like I said, because y'all niggas went crazy. From the beats and such, to the freakiness of some of them, and to like that. It's basically like this. You already know, when it comes to Music Mayhem, I make sure I pick songs that are actually fire. Well, I'm not trying to say all of them aren't going to be fire. But I try to pick songs that you know really can catch me and such. Give me that shock value, you can say. But either way, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. Make sure to check out my other reaction right here and such. It's probably the token reaction, so make sure you go check it out. But either way, it's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. And if you made it to the end of this reaction, of this music mayhem, comment down below. Freakiness, and that makes me know you made it to the end. But it's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up, and hit that subscribe button because we on the road to two K. And hit it or else, safe. Or I'ma send Freddy on y'all asses. There you go.